is our next question of CAT 2006 actual question paper series. This is again one of the easiest question of CAT 2006 but conceptual. The question is in front of you. I would say please pause the video and solve the question. I hope you have solved the question. An answer of this question is option number 5. Why so? In this we have to find the ratio of number of employees who are graduated and above to that employee who are not. Means we have to find the ratio of two mutually exclusive set. Whenever we have to find the ratio of two mutually exclusive set, we can say we can find the summation as nothing but the summation of these two ratios or their multiples. What I am saying is if graduate to non graduate is 108 is to 88, so we can say this one is nothing but x and x as a common factor, so total is 189x. So the total number of employees in this company. And we know 189 is not a prime number, so this number cannot be a prime number. Here the summation is 187 and the number of implies should be in the form of 187x. This is nothing but 221x. This one is nothing but 183x and this one is 181x. This one is not a prime, this one is not a prime, this one is not a prime. And this only a single option where our summation is 181x is a prime number where x is equal to 1. So this one is our answer. I hope this one is clear. You can ask a question. How could we find these are not a prime? You have to check by the derivative rule. And there is no other tool to find number is prime or not. Okay. I hope this one is clear. If you have any doubt, feel free to ping me. Thank you and happy learning.